Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So with the rollout of Windows 11 24H2, as we have been talking about on the channel, Microsoft is making it increasingly difficult to be able to install Windows 11 24H2 on unsupported hardware and has blocked some of the bypass options that were previously available uh, to install Windows 11 on hardware that does not meet the system requirements. Now, something Rufus did recently, which I actually didn't post on, but just a quick recap, Rufus recently um, published a workaround which, if you don't know what Rufus is, it's a popular third-party app um, which can be used to um, bypass the system requirements if you are trying to install Windows 11 on unsupported hardware. And the workaround was commands that you could run that would delete information from the registry in order to be able to install Windows 11 on unsupported hardware, um, the 24H2 annual update on unsupported hardware. And this was allowing users to install an in-place upgrade on machines running Windows 11 already. Now, just to let you know that Rufus has recently rolled out a beta version of the app. And although I don't recommend installing Windows 11 on unsupported hardware, just to let you know that Rufus 4.6, which is now in beta, integrates the code that was previously available as a manual um, kind of commands you had to run. Those, those commands now are integrated in version 4.6. So when you use Rufus to create a Windows 11 version 24H2 installation ISO or USB drive, it will now automatically apply the fix to the image without you having to run those commands. And if we click on the beta version, this will take you over to GitHub where obviously it's maintained and developed. We can see add a new setup.exe wrapper to bypass Windows 11 24H2 in-place upgrade restrictions. So just take note though that this is not working with the stable 4.5. This is working with the beta. So it's still in effect in preview. So obviously there could be a couple of bugs, but nonetheless, if you are wanting to install 24H2 for whatever reason on unsupported hardware, version 4.6 will work. And I'll leave um, the site down below in the description uh, if you'd like to come over and download the beta version of Rufus um, just for easy access and reference. That'll be in the description. And just take note though, although Rufus 4.6 has the bypass now to install Windows 11 24H2 on unsupported hardware. As I've posted previously, if your PC does not support SSE 4.2, which is a CPU requirement, that is still blocked by Microsoft. Rufus will not help with that. That is completely blocked by Microsoft. And I will leave a video linked down below and in the end screen regarding CPUs with SSE 4.2 um, that are now strictly required to upgrade to Windows 11 24H2. That will be um, for you, linked down below and in the end screen if you'd like to go check that out. So Rufus 4.6 beta at this stage works. But obviously we are dealing with Microsoft, so Microsoft could block the option um, to bypass the requirements using Rufus. Obviously um, that can happen any time, but for now 4.6 works. So if for whatever reason, you want to install that on unsupported hardware, the feature update, go check that out. And as mentioned, that link will be down below. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.